Business and Bourbon. From Business and Bourbon, I am Ronnell Richards, and this is Day Drinking, your daily dose of business motivation, inspiration, and education. A bite sized version of Business and Bourbon wisdom to help you on your journey to personal and professional success. Well, happy Monday, guys, and welcome to Day Drinking. Very happy you joined me today. Um, I know that we're starting a new week, and you know we've all accepted our new normal, and we're trying to make it happen. However, you know I'd be remiss if I didn't take some time to really talk about what's going on in our world and um, how that affects us. Right? Um, as we start Mondays, I always look at Mondays as just—it's my favorite day for a lot of people. I know we're taught that Mondays are supposed to be the worst day, right? Oh, man, I got to go back to work. But for me, Mondays are exciting because Mondays give you nothing but potential, right? Nothing has happened yet. Um, We have nothing but opportunity in front of us. So Mondays are exciting. Mondays should be exciting. Monday is something that you should look forward to because it's giving you, again, an opportunity to make something great happen. That's the beginning of the race, not the end. So as I open up and, and, and I look at the news, right, because we all get bombarded by this by the news every day, um, whether it be through your phones, whether it be on TV, whether it be through your social media outlets, we're bombarded by news. I'm going to share just a couple of quick stories with you guys, and I want you to bear with me as I open up my phone and I look at the, the, the stories that pop right up when I when I open my phone. First one. A CNBC article, damage from the coronavirus is hitting the lowest level of wage earners the hardest. Reuters, U.S. response to virus splinters into acrimony and uncertainty. Why China, not the U.S., remains key to Asia's trade and economy recovery? The pan- This is Forbes here. The pandemic blues. Economies are in deep, deep trouble. The World Economic Forum, as coronavirus shocks the energy sector and economy, is now the time for a new energy order? Here's what I what I want you guys to take from this. This news is all negative. It's all negative. Right? It's just and it's it's pervasive and it's impactful because it's all over the place and it's negative. So what I want to encourage you guys to do today Turn all this shit off. Turn it off. All right? The TV, the phones. Turn it all off because all of those stories that I just read, how many of those affected my day this morning? And what I mean by that is how many of those stories, when I woke up this morning, when you woke up this morning and had your Cheerios or had your oatmeal, whatever, were directly affected right in that moment by that story? For most of you, you're not. For most of you, you aren't. However, that negativity that comes from these stories will affect your day. They'll affect your week. They'll affect how productive you are. So I want to encourage you guys to to shut all this stuff down. And remember, again, we're starting the race today. This is an exciting day. And if it's part of your cadence to get up in the mornings and and check out the news, whatever, through your Apple, through your Amazon, Alexa, through whatever it is, just stop it. Let's 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 try some something new. Let's try a new morning cadence. Okay? Because this stuff is not productive for you. It is not helping you to reach your goals. Uh some of this stuff, yeah, they are realities of our world, but are they realities of your world? Are they affecting your world today? But they can affect your mood. They can affect your productivity because they bring negativity to you. So cut it off. Let's start anew. Let's try something new today. Get your coffee. Get your tea. Get your water. Whatever it is. Do some meditation and get ready to win because this is the most exciting day of the week. You've got nothing but potential ahead of you. Now go win it. Thanks again for listening, guys, and I appreciate you. If you love the the show, please rate and review it. Please share it with your friends. Um, 
that that means a, a whole lot to me and it and it helps us in terms of of spreading the message. Um, and also please make sure you subscribe to the Business and Bourbon podcast as well as um, subscribe to the content online. We are on LinkedIn, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and uh, a ton of new content every day. So thank you again, guys. Have a fantastic day and go win this week. Thank you for listening to Day Drinking by Business and Bourbon. If you enjoyed our show, you can support it by rating us five stars and reviewing on Apple or your favorite podcast platform. Hey, I'd also like to invite you to join our movement to combat entrepreneur porn. You can do that by signing up for a free membership on the Business and Bourbon Network. You'll have access to exclusive content and forums where you can collaborate and uncover new business opportunities, jobs, investors, and further your business education. You can sign up at businessandbourbon.net. Again, that's businessandbourbon.net. Thank you for listening. And remember, your success is based on the little things you do each day, not the massive actions. Go out and execute the little things with discipline and consistency, and you'll be a winner in life and business.